Ed Brown, or Big Ed, features on the fourth season of TLC's 90 Day Fiancé before the 90 days. But he took some heat from Twitter after amateur detectives discovered he used to look much different. Thankfully, he's taking it all in stride. Here's what Big Ed looked like back in the day. I actually gave myself the name Big Ed because I have a huge personality and it makes me feel tall. Also, it's funny because I'm not tall. The photos, shared many thousands of times over across social media, showcase how Big Ed was actually quite muscular and in good shape once upon a time. One Twitter user shared the message, quote, "'Fam, this used to be Big Ed,' alongside a side-by-side -side comparison of then and now, which incorporated arguably the most famous shot of the reality star. A screen grab from the show with Ed splayed out in a hotel bed with his girlfriend Rose, his hair very much askew. Likewise, another user made an entire collage to highlight the significant difference, tweeting throwback images of Big Ed shirtless and bronze to perfection. Harshly captioning it, Big Ed's glowdown is catastrophic. I'm self-conscious of my physical appearance because Rose is 31 years younger than me. At 54, the breakout reality TV star is more than twice the age of his 23-year-old Filipino crush Rose, according to People magazine. And fans of the show have relentlessly pointed out that he looks it, too. But if these old pics are anything to go by, there was a time when Big Ed was much more of a stud. Ed confirmed to TMZ that the photos are indeed actually him, and that they were taken way back in 1988. That one particular shot of Big Ed lounging seductively was even taken on a date with his now ex-wife. The 90 Day Fiancé star has no idea how the photos got out, but guesses they must have been swiped from his private Facebook page. Although he initially seemed hesitant, Big Ed was eventually happy to get in on the nostalgic photo action himself, even sharing another throwback shot with TMZ that he also proudly put up on his own Instagram page. He may be younger and smaller, but the man is unmistakably Ed. He captioned the pic, waited tables to earn his master's degree in architecture circa 1995. The reality star and photographer, who says his business has skyrocketed since season 4 of 90 Day Fiancé before the 90 Days debuted, filled fans in a little more on the story behind the photo, according to TMZ. As the outlet reported, the photograph was taken at a restaurant called El Torito in Southern California. Funnily enough, the pose Big Ed is striking bears a remarkable resemblance to that in the shot of him which originally went viral. Maybe back in the day, this was Ed's go-to move. Hi. Do not believe in love. Throughout his short time on the show, Big Ed has proven to be one of the most divisive stars in the history of 90 Day Fiancé, thanks in large part to his treatment of Rose, which many fans believe is rude and unfair. Black hair it just seems kind of less feminine for a woman, so it, yeah, I don't, I don't like black hair. It's gross. However, he has since courted controversy all on his own, after claiming to be the quote, most authentic reality star who has ever appeared on the show, in comments shared by Instagram meme account Mommy Says Bad Words. Naturally, his series co-stars weren't having any of it, with OG's Larissa Dos Santos Lima, Tim Malcolm, and Lisa Hamm all rushing to call him out. In Touch Magazine reports Lisa responded, "'Your statement is really a myth because the real MVPs are the fans. Any 90-day production is truly a team effort. No one is an instant celebrity.'" Don't freak out. <laughs> Oh my god, don't freak out. Tim quickly agreed, quipping that Ed must be, quote, going delusional. Big Ed immediately blocked Lisa, of course, suggesting he's not willing to argue his point. Larissa, meanwhile, who is arguably the most well-known 90 Day Fiancé star, delivered a chilling warning, telling the outlet, "...as a former star on the show who had the most tweets on Twitter and hits on Instagram during my season, I was quickly pushed aside. For good or bad, I brought in ratings, but I was always replaceable. Ed would be wise to learn humility." For myself, I have to see this through and hoping to see you on the other side. Check out one of our newest videos right here! Plus, even more list videos about your favorite celebs are coming soon. Subscribe to our YouTube channel and hit the bell so you don't miss a single one.